should be live now. The audio on this game is quite loud. It, it might sound like I'm talking louder than usual. But yeah, we're gonna tr we're gonna try and scrape scrape ourselves through this game. Uh, I did I, I did have a little dabble in it yesterday, like just do a bit of reconnaissance to see if I like it or not. And uh, it turned out I had to change I had to change Game Boy Advance emulator or the the, the core on Retro Arts because. When I when I loaded this one at the start of the game, as soon as you boot it, you get you get like ear rape in your ear like for about two seconds, and then when every time you go from screen to screen, you get this like ear rape sound, like a little screech sound, like it's like a second long, like a little blip. But it's like oh, I, I thought it was in the game, and then I, and I had a, and I looked on Google to see uh, what's the best core. Well, I typed in the emulator that I was using to say, oh, audio issues. And then someone said they were having the same issue, like some games have it. And then I, I looked up what's the best Game Boy Advance core for RetroArch. And I used it, I'm using a different one now, so there should, the, the audio is fine now. But anyway, let's uh, start a new game. And th this one's pass password based. Like, if I wanted to continue, I've got to put a password in. And I don't know how long this game is, but... It's, 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 an it's an interesting one. It's like top-down, like isometric sort of Tomb Raider. So, I, I, at first, I thought it was a remake of the first game because it had the same settings for the first level. But I, I don't know. I, I only played it a little bit just to see if I like it or not. But anyway, let's uh, start. Let's start. I like that, but I'll skip this before. Room of Ezekiel. And I also looked at Tomb Raider's 25th anniversary. I was, I, I was just looking to see what the new, if there's a, a new Tomb Raider game coming out. And then I've ripped, I spotted that it's the 25th anniversary. And and how they're celebrating it is like spitting in the spit in the face of a, of the uh, the classic Tomb Raider fans. You never guess what we're getting. All, all you're getting is a, a reboot of the three trilogy games. No, a trilogy of the three reboot games, digitally only, and a cookbook. Yeah. Mm, looks like a long way up. Next time I should get another helicopter pilot. As you can see there, like isometric sort of thing. So you could jump. And the action button to like pick up stuff and interact with stuff. I'm a bit, I'm a bit nervous whether I can beat it or not because these sort of games, you've probably got a lot of backtracking, and you can easily get lost. And I looked on eBay to see if I can find a physical copy. And it's, you can find it, but they're mostly French copies. And R1 gets the guns out, and then action to shoot. Yeah, I've never played a Tomb Raider game like this. I thought that, that, that was a medipack, so you push select, and then we can see our inventory screen. You see what I mean? Each time I went in between screens, on the old Game Boy emulator, there'd be like, a, like an ear rape sound. I say ear rape because it's like quite discomforting. Just randomly hearing it. It sounds it sounds like walkie-talkie sort of sound, like as if he's like turning on a walkie-talkie, like a little screech sort of sound. Right, the tome of Ezekiel referred to this plateau. There's a way to get in. And we've got the the GBA shader on, so it looks authentic. Playing it without the shader still looks okay, but it looks a bit blurred. Alright, so that's the title screen. The Prophecy. You see, I mean, this, this level looks like the first level in Tomb Raider 1. That's what I thought, is this a remake? Like, or a reimagined? That's all, that's all gaming studios are doing nowadays, it's just 
remastering games instead of making new content. That turns the flames off. We're gonna come up here because I found there's some there's some objects up here that you can pick up. Like right, some extra. Uh, Sonic is getting a bad treatment at the moment. All, they, all I keep seeing about is remastering Sonic Colors, remastering Sonic Adventure 1 and 2, and then it's remastering Zelda Skyward Sword. Oh, they're, they're like spitting in our faces, like... <clears throat> I can handle this. Like, they can't be bothered to make new content. As soon as we come down here, he's going to start... Yeah, you can, these, these sort of games, they're a bit intimidating, because I know, I'm not, I know later on I'm going to get lost. Like, I'm not knowing my way around. At the moment, I'm okay, because I've already seen this little bit. I, play, I played up to the point where there's a skeleton enemy, and then I decided to stop. If you just walk off, you're going to die. You've got a whole bead to drop off the ledge. Because if you just walked off, you won't land on that edge. You'll end up dropping all the way down here. Yeah, you end up dropping all the way down to here and just dying. And once, you, once, you, once an enemy appears on the screen and you're shooting, it automatically locks on it. So you can like strafe around in a circle around it. It's quite good. But when there's more enemies on the screen, we could, I can show you. So this button could turn that off. I think, I think we're going to be coming back up here. What does this do? Well, that opens that. I think there's a another button that opens something else. You see what I mean? Like I, can, I can sort of strafe, strafe around it. That's time it showed me my way. Right, so let's open that door. Nothing down here. But yeah, I've been on a bit of a binge Tomb Raider. I quite, I quite like them. Will you push that button? What's up here? That's Uzi ammo. So I don't, I don't know if there's like something. These are doors or something. I don't, I don't know too much about this game. So I'm going to be saying I, I think a lot, which I do. I say quite a lot. I say I think, I think, and I say like in between each word. Freaking millennial. Right, so this door. coming across there. We can't get up there. We've got to jump across the gaps. You, you know how far I've got when I'm starting to question what I'm doing, but at the moment I know what I'm doing.
Did, you know when I we just in we just changed screens like that. You'd hit on on the other emulator that I was using. You'd hear like that ear rape sound. sort of walls that you see in a... Uh... You can't get up there. In the, in the first Tomb Raider. That's what I thought. Is this is this like a reimagining of uh, the first game? Oh, that's, that makes the flames go. So what was up here? And so we want to get we want to get to that door there. Uh, so I mean, this where it gets a bit intimidating, where you've got to remember where you've been and not been. That opens. Oh, that stops the flames there. Game, game, gaming nowadays, like modern games, they're like shit. They're not worth bothering with. But they're, they're trying to put the prices up on everything. But you're not getting the quality. You're, you're not. You're, you're not. Get, you're not. It's not justifying the price. What does this lead to? I think this leads to some items. It does. I remember. I remember. There's like a, a large medi pack and a small medi pack around here. It, it, it looks like you can't make it, but you can. We came from up there. Opens the first gate there. If so I open the second gate, we'll go all the way back round again. to open this door here. open that door. But when we get to the when we get to the point where we, we're seeing a, a, a skeleton enemy and it's 
all then it's all blind from there. So I defeated the enemy, the skeleton enemy. Then I stopped. But right, we've we, we've gone a bit too far. Let's let's uh let's stream it. I had a really nice sandwich earlier, bacon, lettuce, tomato. I had like nine, I had about nine, nine rashers of, of smoked streaky bacon. Two, two or three bits of lettuce, round lettuce, that's so the floppy lettuce, and half a tomato. It's just so uh, satisfying. Where are we going first? Here first. Oh, shh. oh, I thought I thought I messed it up there. And it's password based. If I push pause, you can see the password. Hakes. I'm not sure if I should have gone here first. Oh. So we did need to come there first. That's, that's, that's got rid of the, the uh, spikes. What? I didn't touch that. This way. Oh, we're going the wrong way. We just came down from there. Backtrack a bit. You see what I mean? You can easily get lost a bit. Where, where where did we want to go? That's where we went, and we had to came, come back. So that opens that door.
da, 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 da. we need to come back. There's a uh, a gold a gold axe that we need to get. Get more complex later on. Like it's obvious, isn't it? Here, could be where the uh, the axe is. Sitting here thinking that we had to do something here. There's nothing, it's just a hint of what you need to do. But like these, the, each statue is holding a weapon, but the other one is missing one. So that's just to let you know, right, what you need to do with this, uh, this golden axe. Out. The enemy is going to get more tougher than that, isn't it? Like the, ske the skeletons took a few uh, bullets. Right, so to, to, to open this, we need the uh, the decorative battle axe. If they place the king's tomb up there, they must have had a reason. A tomb harder to worship means a tomb holding some secret. Right, so we, when we pull this, there's going to be a timer. But before we do that, I want to pick this up first. But if you pick this up on the way, you don't you, you don't have enough time. You got the uh, the tick 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 tick. See if I have to get a cold. <laughs> yeah, I played quite I played quite far in, didn't I? Before I uh, decided, right, we're going to stream it. Because uh, as soon as we see an enemy, that's a skeleton, a skeleton with a sword and shield. That's where I stop. I promise. Controls are nice and ni nice and tight. But they're not 
they're not clunk they're not clunk they're not clunky like um Tomb Raider Legends. They're like really really responsive. Vargs Vargston, the path of the wolf. You're right there, it looks like you can't make it, but you can look. Let's just use a medipack. We've got enough. Look, we've got 17. Uh, more, I think more Uzi, more Uzi weapons, ammo. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure if there's any swimming bits. I was just checking if there's something down there like to pick up. Yeah, I'm giving people something to watch on a Sunday. There's a lot of streamers take Sunday and Saturday off, or just Sunday, so then Twitch is like dead on a Sunday. There's nothing to watch. Like my, my, most Sundays I'm sitting there look scrolling and scrolling, looking for something to watch and it's nothing. So I might as well fill the gap to someone else. Someone might be browsing to some uh, Tomb Raider content. There's loads of games on the Game Boy Advance that I'm interested in. I downloaded uh, Mario Kart Super Circuit. I downloaded Tanoa, Tanoa Empires the Dreams. I downloaded Rayman 3. Uh, Sonic Advance 2. The, the, I, I download the, 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 the potential ones that I want to I wanna play. Like I, I'm, not, I'm not downloading like, just, like, stuff that's just going to sit on my computer. Once I've finished it, I delete it. I don't uh, flood the uh, hard drive. But I should I should maybe put them on like an SD card or something. This is where it gets a bit tricky. Look, we push that. That turns the flames off there. But the, the 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 objective is to get rid of these spikes. We're, ne we're nearly up to the bit where I just stop playing. If all right, we're going to stream it now. As so we come across here, Watch that that opens that. That opens that second gate. Where did we start? We came from here, didn't we? Uh, 
We know you've got Sind there. Well, that turns the flames off. Right, and this, this button we're going to push now is going to start another timed thing. And I, 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 I pushed this thinking that it's made the, made the spikes go down. And I rushed all the way back. And they were, they were still there. But what he actually does is take turn these off for, t uh, for a brief amount of time. You've got to be quick. That's another timed one. Oh, so this one gets rid of the spikes. This one opens the first gate. And this turns the flames off again. There's gonna be some areas where there's gonna be like hidden, hidden, hidden rooms where you've got a if you walk towards there or something, and there's like something like an area hidden out of sight. <laughs> Terrible, right? This is it the skeleton, the skeleton enemy. That took, and I and this is where I stopped. I got to here and then stopped. So I don't know what anything beyond here. I don't know. Oh, all right, that's it. <laughs> it's on. Let's do it. Let's do this game. I don't know which is the main way we want to go. That looks like the way into another screen. So how long has this been going on for? About half, about 30 minutes. King here. King no heart. Here it lies here. Is it is it heart? It doesn't look like an A for heart. It looks like Hewitt. Hewitt. Hewitt lies here. His legend will be immortal for death. Which I respect his sons. The door there. And I'm not sure if this is all one level or it's just going on, because if I push pause here, it gives me the password tree. So I'm not sure how far back like each password goes. Uh, 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 
it looks like spikes are gonna trigger somewhere. Oh, <laughs> yeah, let's open that. Something, something's triggered. Yeah, there's a sword there. And looks like something goes down there. How creepy that is, like they're hearing the footsteps. Looking De Derek Derek Akora, like haunted, haunt most haunted. Although he was mi a mighty leader, there are only sketchy details about this king's history. Have I gone the right way, or is this the way we have to go? <laughs> Soldiers of King Heert. That's just gone back on ourselves. Go back the other way, because then I'll get a better, a better, a better angle. Oh no! Look, I can't go back. Look, the, the the spikes have gone up. Well, that's what that's what it is. How, were they there before? But I do have to go that way and fight the uh, skeleton from there. But I should have drunk, dropped down and straight away started uh, strafing around. I was right. That opens to that. Was it this door it just opened? This, this, the wolves are, are, are like moving faster. Oh shit. Intense now. now. So where did we come from? We came from Cotton Eye Joe. We came from here. Right, so we need to find something to make the spikes go down. So that leads to there. 
more spikes. I mean, that's what makes me confused. Like, you've got two ways to go, and you don't know if you're going too far the right way or you're going the wrong way. Where else could we have gone? Let's go back. But that's what I do. I go, I inch my way forward, and then I go back and inch my way forward somewhere else to see which is the correct way. So I don't, I don't know if something's leading me off the beaten path or if something's leading me to like something hidden, like a secret or something. Is that led just just to that? Right, so that's the objective. We want the spikes to go down. Or we want the spikes to go down to find something to make these spikes go down. We just don't know. Gonna be shimmying across there. What's that? Collectible. You're right there. I don't know if that is somewhere I can jump to. It looks like a wall. What's this? Shield. We've got the shield and the sword. That looks like a wall. I don't know if I can jump for that. made my spirits drop. So what did we just open? So it's not that far back, really. So let's check if they made them spikes go up. It did. It did. Or something like Jesus Christ, Jesus. the challenge is rising now.
Because I looked at my health. Is this, is this the end of the road, boys? Let me see if I can use this. I can't. Maybe that's why the medipack's there, because he knows we're going to get our asses handed. But we, we, we did it before, didn't I? I strafed around it and everything. Skis. Let's open that door there. This was a, a medipack, wasn't it? Oh, so that's the, obviously the objective way. Yeah, the, 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 the thought was that I could, I had to drop down, but I can't. I thought I can drop down to here. But I think if I drop down, that's a, that's an instant death, isn't it? That's quite far down. I reckon you can make that. Is that a jump? You know that you see like the vertical strip. It looks like a wall or something. We're gonna go for it. I can't see any see any other way. Unless that's just that's the way back. Jump this. You can. It's. I mean, it, from from that angle, it looks like it's a a wall separating the two areas. Look at that. Medi pack. Like that. That makes those go down. I need to uh, open that door. <laughs> yeah, 
He must have used the power of the Blackstone magic that can raise the dead. This would explain why he is remembered only in grim legends and in the tomb of Ezekiel. Okay. I mean, it take, it take quite a lot of ammo to kill. That opens with that. I mean, but I just don't know which is the way. Which is the way? Right, so look, now we're locked, now we're trapped, we're locked in. Where did I just come from? I came from up here, didn't I? So they've trapped us in. Excellent. Where are we going? I mean, it's getting quite intense now. Like where you got, you, you get, you get lost of where you've been or where you, where you're going. Like what was in that door before that we could have opened? Looks like the way that looks, it looks like it's the way out. What? It didn't even touch me! What? It didn't even touch me! And that one's obviously gonna... Bikes go down. That's that type of fuckery, is it? Let's open that up. Finally, this should be the king's tomb. Now let's find the black stone. I 
what are we doing for time? The link. Look now the trip that the password's changed. Changed. I might I might stop here. Just go like per hour or something. Or I could do a bit of reconnaissance and then play. I don't know. But anyway, I'm gonna stop there. So that that was the that we got the we got the ball rolling on this game. The fingers crossed I can finish it. Unless there's complete fuckery at the end or further in the game. Every game has it nowadays, doesn't it? But yeah. Peace.